Okay, AWE TV day one. Uh, we are here with uh, Phil Lamb uh, from AR Toolkit. Can you uh, describe your function in the company? So I'm Chief Open Source Architect at Decker, which uh, gives me the technical responsibility for developing open source frameworks, tools, and applications. And uh, what is AR Toolkit all about, like in a nutshell? So AR Toolkit is an open source framework for uh, image recognition and uh, tracking and for creating uh, augmented reality experiences and it's a developer software development kit and uh, today we've announced uh, the Altera project which is an open source application including content uh, framework for building application and an amazing open world AR experience uh, just to play with as well. So basically AR, AR toolkit is uh, image recognition and tracking uh, software tool engine that is uh, significant in the fact that it's free? It's free and open source. And still with high standards of, uh, of recognition and tracking yes. and all the features? Yeah, so AirTalk has been around a long time. Um, AirTalk 6 is a new generation of this uh, tracking built by Daiquiri, uh, given away to the open source community. And so when is it released? Six? So we're aiming release in October. So, so uh, yeah, and uh, along not only uh, Air Toolkit but also the Altair application and the tools required to build content for that. So that's a big step to say, not just put it in the hands of developers, but to uh, provide a complete structure for building the best possible applications for the And the Altair concept, yeah, can you get us uh, one of the, uh, of the comic books so we can understand what it is? So basically, this is uh, it's a way to showcase your capabilities in a creative way. It's like a game for developers all over the world, right? They can develop on top of it using your version 6 uh, exactly. AR toolkit. What we wanted to do was to say, this is um, an app store ready example of what you can build with the toolkit and to showcase it to it so that we give away the content that runs based on our platform. So basically, once uh, a user downloads the app, the Altera app, it's filled with uh, experiences, quests, gaming, like stages inside? Yes, exactly. We want to create an open world with different uh, types of applications. There's uh, applications focused on education, um, content, apps which are games, apps which have uh, suggest some of the possibilities for industrial AR. So, and extensible. That's uh, we. The Altera is a, a world that you travel to through the application, and it has uh, space for new content. So. Does it only uh, support AR, or also has VR stuff like side by side, like inside tracking? Yeah, it's certainly something that's on the cards. I mean, mixed reality and being able to transition into these experiences is something we'd love to play. The Altera app is already available in iOS and uh, Android? Yeah, so you can download it on the app stores today, uh, iOS and Android app store. And where does, uh, where, if I'm a developer and I want to start using AR Toolkit, okay, where do I get it from? So AR Toolkit is available from the airtoolkit.org website. Um, the current version uh, is version 5.3. Uh, AR Toolkit 6 will be available in October. That's how we now release. We will do previews for um, select customers before the end. Select user groups. And, uh, and if, uh, if a developer or a creative have a cool idea somewhere, that you know they want to play with you guys, like they can contact you as well. Do you share like uh, right, so ideas have, yeah, with we, developers? We have uh, community evangelism and support uh, functions. Uh, we provide uh, online assistance, and we don't do commercial application development uh, for our toolkit users, but we have. Uh, support. Yeah, we have a community panel. These are trusted partners who work with our toolkit in the past. And we'll, uh, we can build commercial applications and provide consulting services and uh, the full, full spectrum. So basically, uh, AR Toolkit is part of the Daiquiri, let's say, envelope of AR everywhere? Exactly. We, uh, open source is an important um, focus for Daiquiri because it gives us a bridge between research, uh, 
education communities it allows us to work openly and to essentially have a two-way transparent development process between um, company and, and external entities. Okay, so let's play, no? Yep. Okay, so Altera is a showcase app uh, showing what Air Toolkit 6 is capable of. Um, it will basically is a space colony. It's got uh, a few different activities. We've got uh, activities within a museum, a school, a factory, and an arcade. Um, and the activity I'm going to show here is the arcade activity. It um, is called Robot Mayhem and it um, is, uses a single image target and you track that target and there are different drones and robots that will be shooting at you. And uh, you just have to shoot back as long as you can um, and uh, see how long you can survive. So um, I'll show you now. Uh, so here the uh, drones come to life and you fire at them and you're, uh, they're shooting back at you so you're kind of dodging the missiles. There's health pickups, you can pick up the health and uh, they'll just keep going. If you fire too much you'll um, run out of ammo and it has to recharge so you got to make sure you keep dodging while, uh, while you're recharging there. And uh, you just keep shooting them and uh, Wait until uh, wait until you get get overwhelmed by the by the robots. Eventually, it will happen, um, and then uh, it's kind of game over at that point. Um, and then you just uh, start over and see how far you can get.